for expecting moms, COVID-19 has added a lot of unknowns to an already tough and sometimes uncertain time of our lives. Since the virus is so new, we don't know a lot about how the disease affects pregnancy. Chief photographer Stephanie Nolte shows you a first of its kind study that may have found a link between COVID-19 and placenta abnormalities. And today's the Rebound Heartland Mother's Week. A small study of 16 women, all who had COVID-19 during their pregnancy, finds a new complication, injury to the placenta in all 16 women. There was a change in those arteries on the maternal side that transmit the oxygen and nutrients to the baby. And it appears that there was some effect then um, that could potentially have downstream effects for the, for the fetus. The placenta acts as the fetus's lungs, gut, kidneys, and liver. This study by Northwestern Medicine finds insufficient blood flow from the mother to the fetus, which might interfere with the placenta's role in getting oxygen and nutrients to the growing baby. Study co-author Dr. Emily Miller says she doesn't want to paint a scary picture, but is worried. The placenta acts like a ventilator for the fetus, and if it gets damaged, there can be dire outcomes. In this very limited study, these findings provide some signs that the ventilator might not work as well for as long as we'd like it to. Even if only half of the placenta is still working, she points out, babies are often completely fine. Dr. Patel says it's encouraging COVID-19 doesn't seem to be directly passed downstream from mother to fetus, but she agrees with closer monitoring. Things like growth restriction, potentially preeclampsia, uh, things like that that can that can then manifest because of those changes in the placenta. The study raises a lot of questions about how COVID-19 affects pregnancy. More research still needs to be done. In Omaha, Stephanie Nolte, 3 News Now. Again, this study was done with a small group of women and doctors say more research still needs to be done.